I don't like this. That, that was a slap on my face. Yeah? You know, we should have avoided that in the first place. You know how much I, I dislike things of such nature. Yeah? And since then, my heart has been pounding because you got me frightened. You didn't take part in the, in the fight, yet your heart is pounding. Why not? I don't know why. That shows that you're a weak man. Just preaching peace and all that. Excuse me. Are you are you saying I'm not money now? Uh, well, not really. That's not. You said it, and that's not what I said. Mom, you should have avoided such degradable show. What was that? Do you know who you're talking to? Eh? My show. Yeah. Please, 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 please. Spare me all that. Alright? If trouble comes my way, I'd fix it squarely. Simple. You go and change now. Sorry, yeah. Oh, that's how you're not telling me sorry. Oh, okay. See how you're telling me so sorry, eh? I see from somebody that you picked on the streets. Okay. My lord. My sister. Instead of saying that you wanted to kiss me, did you get the sound? The tiger. Like Tomorrow, you go and fight again. The cycle, we are starting by the wayside. Okay. You have called me to the corner. You know I'm not after how much was he. You. Kenneth there will be no need for such public embarrassment anymore. You hear me? Mom, please, you should let certain things pass. Not everything needs a retaliation. Please, everything needs a retaliation. If I let it pass tomorrow, it will come again. So if you deal with it at that moment, then there's no trouble in the future. And as for you, stop holding down your crutch. I've told you, you're not a boy. That doesn't make you strong or make you a man. If you don't have the, the property, you don't have the property. No. Next time, I can't wait for the day that they will beat you mercilessly outside. Mm -hmm. yeah, I'm serious. Mm -hmm. Next time, don't be like this. They will lock you. <laughs> now you're the one in beans. Mm -hmm. eh? yeah. If I take my daughter to go. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Yes. This has only taught me one lesson. Every morning before I go, I will eat correct fufu, send it home so that anybody that attacks me on the way will be properly dealt with. Wonderful. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Please, 
Which one of them sent such words from the village? I am suspecting it must be a switch. You know that man. Nothing good comes out of his mouth except trash. Well, that's beside the point. What is hurting me now is my husband. My husband is no more. Oh, it's okay. There's nothing we can do about it now. That is gone. Please. Who will you be able to straighten our bones? That's all. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. I'm never tired of crying. No more tears. I wish the tears would come. That's why I won't be having this thing in my chest. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. We'll be fine. We need to put ourselves together. What has happened has happened. So we have to face the realities of life. It's a pity. It's really a pity. You're right. If you don't want to travel to the village to move, it's not a thing that's happening. You just have to be strong and reach out. If you just face this reality, how will you still have to move? Okay? How will you still have to move? How will you still have to move? No, well, we'll be fine. We'll be all right. Just have to prepare our hearts for the challenges ahead. We know we are rich, yes. But then we are a strong woman. It's true. I know we're both in this. Yes. Oh, now, she's not back here. Let's try to put our things together now so that it'll be easy for us. See this one. Oh, we are yeah. an expert of all events. This guy. Yo! Allah, 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 Man, it's been a while, it's been long. How are you doing, bro? I um, I just did, I just did, I just did. Hey! ZK! Man! No, 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 of course not. That's not that shit. Get our bad guy. DK, Bob, see my guys looking fresh and fly. Uh, uh, when do I enter town now? Man, actually, we've been in town for a while. We only live, so just say, let's do it local style. <laughs> oh, you know? Come, DK. This one you are staying down here. Dike something is fishing. <laughs> Dike something must be in there. I know you now. Dike! Help come. Which way are you going now? I was going to check on uh, Ebuka up there. But I don't know. I don't see you man. No! Forget about the Ebuka. It's been a while now. So we are going this way first. After flexing and enjoying, we go back to see Ebuka. That's why we are here. <laughs> That's why we are here. <laughs> I don't tell you. Seriously. Now that you guys are in this village, trust me, our girls are in trouble. <laughs> of course, they are in trouble. <laughs> Look at this one, DK. I just wish you can reach the megaphone to sound it so loud to enter this human being here, to enter his ear. Because I've been, I've, I've been begging him, I've been persuading him to use this opportunity and at least speak your wife. But I think 
this man is choiceless. <laughs> because he will see fat girl is the best, slim one is the best, shobby. I beg, let's talk another thing, I beg. <laughs> That's a hot one on you, man. Hot punch. Man, friends, I'll get married, but it's not just about getting a woman. What about a woman with character, with intelligence? A woman that can pass good virtue to your children. That's the kind of woman I'm looking for. <laughs> and when I see her, I'm getting married. I can't wait to see your wedding day. The way I'm seeing this man getting married now. It's not in his agenda. So let's just forget it and say something else. Ah. So, DK, tell me, how has life been now? So tell me, how has life been treating you? Business? Well, bro. Huh? Hey, brother, the street is military. Bro. Ah. <laughs> Are you going to be here now? I'll be. will be here and the alpha now. Today, sir. Tomorrow, Bella. Next, see. tomorrow, street fight. I, I wish right. I can just raise money and travel to Malaysia. DK. Don't tell me you still fight. Diki, so you still make crack rival. I think this is good things now. I demand a car of Kumba. I don't know the police say we're gonna offer you. Diki, Abi, this guy, you will never change. I was thinking all this fight and grigri is just for the age or something. Put on, put on small Vitaly. What I'm doing now, the food now, I'm gonna put my food now, I'm gonna put my food now. There is no water here for you to help yourself out. This wall is choking you. But I bring water now. This guy will give you without water, so bring water back. Let them bring water and you are rushing it. Let them bring water. If I tell you what did happen, you know what's in my brain. I think they tell you. You better, you better swallow. Idiot. You better comport yourself. Eat like a gentleman, okay? I heard that DK has traveled out, is it? That was my mom you want to hear yes, say DK travel. Abi, Abi, what if I say me because I'm DK now? Eh? I mean, I mean, body, mama, I didn't die in grandma, we die for that. I don't know what I don't die, they survive for great care. Tell you what, God tell me. Man, you make a chop my food out there. Amen. Amen. Oh, I agree. Oh, Suji, there is something disturbing me. I don't like that woman and her daughter's countenance. Who are they? I am prepared more than they are. Let's begin as if you don't know what Ojibwe can do. Leave them for me. Ah, my prayer is we should do everything we can to make sure that this woman succumb to our plans. We make sure we humiliate her. We make sure she did not have any 
access to our brother's uh, properties, they must surely succumb after killing our brother Hi. with her rape and arrogance. She thought that we will allow her to acquire all the properties. No, it's impossible. No. We will not allow no her way. to do that. No way. Eh? Listen, first and foremost, she must have to fulfill all the traditional rights. Yes. Then you will see me in action. I will make sure that I will not allow her to touch a single pain without my brother's access. I must fight in the enemies to make sure. In fact, I will fight in any way I like. Spiritually, emotionally, psychologically, with the gun, boat, and arrow. Just anything. Proceed, my brother. I am solidly behind you. Any way that woman wants it, we'll give it to her. We'll tell her that we own this place. What an arrogant and a frivolous woman. We will deal with her. Let us. Let us. She's, she's, she's not seen anybody. She's a catacolous woman. Give her that water. Give her the water. She won't finish it. Shut up. What's happening to you? What's going on? Say, you have no respect for our tradition. What is wrong with you? Hey, what's it? You, you throw away this water. Yes. And I will trade it with you. Okay. 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 Are you ready to fix a date for your brother's burial? <laughs> yes, I'm ready. Did you hear her question? Can we fix a date for the burial of the deceased? Your brother! Yes, sir. Yes, Yes, Papa. I just break hey, I will deal with that woman and those her daughters. They, they, they think it's over. It's not over. This is just the beginning. I will deal with that. It's not over yet. It's not over. Hey! Oh, but there's something disturbing me. Oh, my hearing him so good. You know, with intimidation, we have fixed the better day. Forget about it. We know what to do next. They think that we are playing. Forget about that. We know what to do next. Edisha, don't trust me. Edisha, take it. So Uncle Osuji, in all his ranting, could dread the threat of some men? <laughs> Lousy man. Hmm, that man. But anyway, thank God they didn't fix the dates. Because that was our major concern. Those men were trying to spoil things for us. They are trying to ruin everything. They can't try it. They dare not try it one and there. No, no. Hmm. It's not possible. Ah, no, 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 no. no. But they can't try it. I trust you. I know what you can't do. You know me. What's <laughs> wrong with those people? Mom, we're with you all the way. All the way. I trust we're all in. I right? trust my girls. Thank you very much. We're very grateful. You're welcome. Are you sure you won't be needed us in subsequent times? No, I don't think so. But if the need arises, I'll place a call through to you. Alright, you know where to find me. Is everything there? Complete. Everything. Everything. Trust me. Alright, thank you. Yeah. Thank 
What <laughs> it seems they have gone. Madam, finally, of course. They think that it's all over because the timing has taken place already. Teresa is a liar. She's a very big liar. She do not know that this is just the beginning. Like I said earlier, that I will physically fight with that woman. I fight her physically, emotionally, spiritually, on other. I can even use God to chase her to make sure that I deal with her. I told you that I'm solidly behind you. Thank you we will deal with this woman. I get even one here. That cannot mean why in the hell are you mad at I get me some. I will deal with this woman. I am not going to Come here, come back here. What is the meaning of this? What are you putting on? If somebody sees you dressed like this, what would the person call you? A boy or a girl? Which one? Eh? Look at, look at what she's giving you. Just the one. Madam, will you mind your business? What's your problem? Me, mind my business. When you dress like this. Eh? I know you like proper husband. Because you don't have home training at all. That is why you go about insulting other things. Look at, look at how you dress. Even if you insult me, I'm not surprised. Oh, so you probably gossiping about me. See? That I, beat the, I talk to elders anyhow, right? Look at yourself. Okay? I know you're useless because no man will marry you like this. I'm useless. Of course you are. You're useless. No man can marry you like this. No man. You said me I'm useless. You are useless. I'm hey! useless. Whatsoever to stand against our tradition. Who do you think you are? I am Teresa. A woman that knows her right in her husband's home and in the society. I owe you nothing. You lie! You owe us a lot. As long as you are married to our brother, you owe us your total submission to fulfill this obligation. Yes! I will not do that. Huh? Yes. If you like, you can stand there and rant. And say whatever you like, I will not listen to you. But let me tell you something, eh? Be ready to dance to the tune of the Egedege dance that only you can hear. This woman has a lot of courage. No wonder, look at her, look at how she's dressed. Mm -hmm. Wearing her shape, instead of mourning her husband, look at her. Is that the genesis of the Osoka also? Okay, we're not yeah? The one bee that is killing you people. <laughs> Where we are dressed, <laughs> it's none of your business. Anyway, we decide to mourn our husband and our father. And besides, my husband, while he was ill, said that any time he passed on, we should look good. Yes! Mom, oh, we should not be sad. What? We should look good. I told you. So your husband knew you were going to kill him. So he was making wishes to you to look good. Plus good hair. Hey! Better. You, you, you killed our brother. You're ashamed of yourself. It's a pity you don't even know what killed your brother. Your brother was in hospital for how many years? Oh. Eh? Suffering from cancer. You never came. You Which never cancer? contributed. Which cancer? Which cancer? Oh, Suji, oh, Suji, oh, 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 eh, eh, oh, 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 was a very strong man. Which cancer? Which cancer? Because yell alone on the But, uh, uh, look, let, let, let me ask you, woman. How dare you stand against the elders of this family and our traditions? Huh? Huh? Mom, please just take it easy. No matter what, they are the elders of this family. Don't leave her, Sumatana. Leave her. Let her show us her muscle. 
Because of those hoodlums she brought the other day. I can make it here. Please, enough of all this you're ranting. Get out of here. Can you please get out of my compound? Eh? You are asked us to get out of her. Our brother's house? Come on! You know, you her. I got to get my name and I'm going to go. You ready to face another phase of your life? Come on. You can't do more than a rotten dead one. But I can't tell you. Ah. Old man, you, as if you are the only elders in this family. Both of you are always sneaking and snooping around. Job place looking for where to eat on you. You be a la usame. Now you can't just keep it open. Teresa! 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 Why is that your stupid daughter who behaves like a boy? Where is she? Who is so stupid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is the matter with you? Why are you shouting? Where is she? Why are you roaring like a, a madman? What is it? Get it for me. Where is the idiot that behaves like a boy? You know, I thought you were a respectable um, elder in this village. But obviously, you are not. You walk in here and, and, and abuse my, my child. What kind of unruly manner of approach is that? You train nuisance. They go about molesting and bullying people who are minding their business. You better warn her. You better warn her before I deal with her. Look at look at what she has done to my wife. Look at the bully coming. This girl really doubts with me. Look at my face. Eh? Look at what she did to me. Look at what she did to me. Look at an ugly woman that the husband has been has been using as a punching bag. Mm -hmm. Says you're the one that gave her all the apple apple. You should be ashamed of yourself. So this small child can beat you up. She's and, not a girl. And then you went and brought this little man to do what? She's a boy. Look, look at what she did to my face. She's not a girl. Because see, Lilo, is it not better to be only like and live up to my responsibility than be a poor grown idle man who sits and depends on his wife's struggle? This useless wife that don't mind her. You are insulting me! Uh-huh. And what will you do? What will you do? You will see. see will. You will hear. No, please. Beca because you are starting a trouble you will not be able to of finish. Of course. Of course, they will hear from us. Let us this go. This is not the end. You are your mother. You should wait for us. Let us go. Who we'll wait for us? Let's go. 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 See the man said, "Super man, you are coming this way." It's Changa now. Oh, 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 Greetings, so. To what do we owe this message? We have come to carry out the own of our tradition. Which is babbing of your hair. It is sign of mourning your husband. Mm -hmm. Babbing of hair. Babbing of hair. Are we still talking about babbing of hair in this day and age? Come on, it's a thing of the past now. I dare you deep fair. It's our tradition. It is our tradition and it has come to stay. Well, I no one can change it. Not even you. Yes. Well, I'm sorry. I will not be a part of this tradition. This is a mandate. And you must comply. Or we force you. Hmm. So you force me to do what? Hmm. Are you crazy or something? You cannot force me to do anything. Because I will do it. We have come here to shave here. Stop talking. It is not possible. You cannot touch my hair. Wait, 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 wait. Yes. Even you. That I paid your son's school fees last week. You're here to shave my hair. I don't blame you people. It's because I'm not part of this village. I'm not from this village. You. I remember about two months ago. 
two women buried their husbands. You personally helped one woman to fix ribbon on her hair on the day of her husband's burial. And now you're here to cut my own hair in a boala. You your cannot try it. Your case is different. We are suspecting you killed your husband, my brother. Prove your innocence by shaving your hair. If you fell to you to this, mm -hmm. consider yourself being cast out of this village. Vanish. Vanish. What? As though we live in an era of, of, of slavery or what? Shut, shut up, up young girl. Yeah. Shut your mouth. Don't tell my daughter to shut up, you woman. Okay, Nedo. Say again, just a moment. Of course, your son's school fees can't be paid again. My mother's please. Go. Return tomorrow for this, please. No. We must do it here and now. What's we'll shave her head? No, Susan. The young girl has spoken well. Let's return tomorrow for this. It is just a few hours. Yes. Yes. Good. Yes. 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 Keep it for me if I come to my place. Julia, my daughter, let me know. 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 Let me they are out for destruction, and, and I'm sure we're not ready for that. <laughs> Just send the dreamer. <laughs> it's like you have under revolution, right? Please, Keke, I wasn't talking to you, okay? It's not a laughing matter. What is it? Uh, we all know it's not a laughing matter. Oh. Well, is there any time you pray and you don't have a revelation under? Is there? Not, please. Hold it. <laughs> I wasn't talking to you, okay? No. What do you think about these women? Because they are very angry. They are out for something. You're right. As a matter of fact, I have no plans for them. I'll just wait for them to come back. Mm -hmm. Then I would know what to do. You're dreamer. Will you two stop teasing and be nice for once? Oh. <sighs> Hey! Hey! What? Hey! Hey! See you! You could die ah! tonight if you wish to! Let this stab as a stern warning to you and your fellow team! Oh, do not! I mean, do not in any way compel Mrs. Zobia to do anything contrary to her wish! You understand me? Do you understand me? And listen, you must not humiliate her in any way, mm. be it by your filthy culture or anything. <laughs> she must be loved, mm. accepted, and treated with respect. Mm. Did you hear? Mm. Mm. She must be recognized in this society. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> See, I'm most important. To you. Are you listening? Mm. Most important. <laughs> 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 Most importantly, there must be no cause for alarm. Mm. Just listen to me. Mm. No cause for alarm. Mm. Else you have yourself to be blamed mm. for what to be for you and your household. Mm. You and your team you should stay away. Mm. Stay away from her. Oh. Because this custom of yours wasn't been planned. Mm. Did you hear? This is so surprising. How did you just uh, suddenly have a change of mind without even informing me? What is it? What has my brother's wife done to you? You, when your sister's husband died, you didn't shave her hair. You came to me and begged me not to allow them to shave her hair. There are other women in this village that their husband died. We did not shave their hair. 
So why will my brother's wife uh, Kate be different? Why? Okay. But why don't you tell other women? Just take the decision yourself. Is it good like that? No. Let's tell ourselves the truth. It's not mandatory that we must shave her hair. You know it's because of her stubbornness that we decided to punish her. So right now I have changed my mind. I have changed. I, I, I am no more interested in shaving her hair. I don't want us to shave her hair again. Okay, how can we know that her hair is clean? That's the problem. Don't worry. This is our family issue. It's our family case. We will sort it out ourselves. Hmm? We will go inside and we'll sort it out. No problem. Who we'll bother yourself? Okay. If you said so, let's do it like that. Exactly. I'm going. Greet your family for me. It's okay. My elders, I'm so relaxed. I, I don't recall inviting you to my house. No, 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 please, hold it. We don't need your invitation before coming to our brother's house. Oh, oh sweetie, the sportsman. Always ready to talk. Well, you've always been the vocal one amongst the rest of them. Now, why are you people here? I'm sure you want to accuse me of not fulfilling some custom or tradition. Um, in case you have forgotten, there is a time when certain rights need to be fulfilled. But in our own tradition, in our own time, you would like to stand against the elders. This time it will not work for you. It will never work. Those traditions must be fulfilled. I am happy you've spoken like men. I mean real men. And I applaud you. So, uh, since our brother is no more, tradition demands that you automatically become the wife one of his brothers. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you me. Okay, so who am I supposed to get married to? Osuji, of course. Mom. Since you have no major to protect our brother properties, Osuji will become your husband to protect all Ozobia properties. Mm -hmm. That is our custom and tradition. What? You guys are jokers. Huh? Stop that nonsense. Why hey. invite this liability to put Mount where that's are discussing the importance of this family? Huh? Please. You can insult me, say whatever you like, bring up any kind of tradition, but don't you ever call my child a liability. I will take that. But do you know that you can be punished, you can be Discipline for this, showing this respect. <laughs> my elders, my elders, I'm very sorry. Please, let the meeting continue. Young no, lady, mm. if you know what is good for you, do not speak in this meeting again. Um, as it starts now, we call this meeting short. Yes. But next week, when we come here, eh, you must have handed over the documents of uh, our brother's property to his brother, Osuji, who is the entire who will become your husband. No problem. All the old and the new ones that you come up with. No problem. And by the time we come, before we come, we send one across to you. Other important custom and traditions that will also need to be fulfilled. Before we come, we we'll send word across to you.
Good. You know, those elders need to be taught a lesson. Then women need to be taught a lesson. Mom, I think we should be more respectful when we relate to them so that they'll just bear the intents of their hearts. You know, just let us know all that they have in your mind. And then we can act on our own accord. I didn't quarrel with anyone. I held my temper because I have a plan. Whatever it is, let's just be done with these family disturbances until we're done with the morning period. I think those macho men will come in handy. The macho men? No. I'm done with them. They need to leave. Mom, I know you're done with them. But I think we can invite Uncle Usuji. Let him come over for lunch. Give him all those things that he likes, you know, and ties him. And, um, you tell him you want to discuss that property and how to share them and stuff, you know? If he decides, if he wants to see some documents, we can provide some fake documents for him. What do the macho men have to do with us? The macho men. Yes, what he has. The macho men would hand on Kosuji a script. Of course, they would be there so that he would heed to the obedience. He would act to, he would have to act out a scene where he would show his aggressive nature. He's going to be very vicious. He would have a knife. He would want you to have sex with him, you know? And then if you don't, if you resist, he would... If you resist, he's going to just, you know, to kill you and your daughters, you know? Something like that. Something very incriminating, so that... I have it in my head, but I'm sure it will work. Oh, it's you, You're a real bitch. Mom, are you sure it will work? Let's just work on this script. I'm the director, you're the producer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. You are producer. I am actor. I am so much of man. I'm the director. Come explain to work. Trust me on this one. I think so. I do know. Let's see how it plays out. Why are you coming to my house? What can I do for you? What's good about this afternoon? Why are you here? Uncle, I know that the present rift in our family has interrupted our relationship. But definitely not the relationship you once had with my father and brother. And that's why I'm here. Then what's your message? Uncle, first and foremost, I want to apologize on behalf of my mother and my sisters. I know they haven't been nice to you. Despite our arguments, you know you have been held in high regard. My father's wish cannot be flaunted. What must be done must be done. What do you want next? Uncle, I want you to come for lunch tomorrow so that you and my mother can talk things over like one family. How could I come to your house to take lunch with your mother? Who is so arrogant? Huh? Eh? Eh? Uncle. It is not possible. The matter at hand now is not about my mother, but your brother. You know you have a place in this neighbor. And we cannot deprive you of what is due. And you know how I hold my father's words. I don't joke with them. Um, what happens that time? I am listening to you because you are quite different from my brother too. Uh, you are a obedient child. You do respect others and you do respect me as well. You do behave like your father, not like your mother. Mm -hmm. So what happens is that uh, I will be there because of you. Mm -hmm. You understand me? But I want you to hold your character. You are doing very well. Mm -hmm. uh, what, uh, uh, what, when do you want me to come? Uncle, tomorrow lunchtime. Okay, that's all right. Uh, I will be there. Eh? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Uh. Call it. Not 
Osuji, I don't know what you are up to. I don't know. Osuji, mm -hmm. is this the same Osuji I know? It's me, Osuji. Is it the same you, the greedy Osuji I know, that is acting like this? I'm surprised. Eh? We all arrange on how to deal with this woman and her daughters to get to, to get our brother properties. Exactly. And share them. Everybody will be living well. You are not asked to hold on, to calm down. Please, what are we waiting for? Listen, listen. Everything is under control. Huh? People should relax. Just relax. Control. Oh, let me tell you. Control no or no control. What I am saying is this. Just have it in mind that I have a share in my brother's property. I don't want to hear story at the end of the day. Did you hear me? It's alright. Uh, if you want to stay, you can remain here. I'm on my way to my house. Uh, I'm going to. I also don't want to hear any story. I don't want to hear. Yeah. I don't know anything. My mom and the lawyer, they've been waiting for you. They want to have a meeting with you. Are they already? Yes, they are the first um, room by the right. Okay, the, the first room on the second room? The first room by the right, on the switch. Okay. Yes. That was only your room. No problem. You'll end this day. <sighs> you got this one, yeah? You do. I just hope he falls into the strap himself. He wants to take over the properties, everything that I gave up for, and then turn me into his wife. Oscar to be precise. Oh, 
I didn't know you could make such a good actress. I can't help it. I never knew this man could be this foolish. Ordinary trial. And he fell like that. Yeah, I knew he would fall for it. I knew he would fall for it. I just knew he was not just greed, but lost as well. Tell me, how many wise men will ask their late brother's wife to come marry them even when he has not been buried? That's absurd. You know, it's a good thing we got this video. I'm going to edit it very well and send it around for the entire village to see how cruel and foolish a respected man like Usuji can be. Exactly. <laughs> Let's see who will be shown by the family and society. You know. This will cause a very big rage between him and the other end. Yeah. <laughs> Don't tell me all this, all this were planned. Oh! It's just... Uh, no! Don't worry, don't worry. It has nothing to do with I'm lost! I know. Oh. Keep your cool. Sweetie, don't worry. <laughs> Grace will find you. Take a chill. Okay. <laughs> She's lost. <laughs> Look at her, of the devil, and she's here. You're a disgrace to mankind. You're an embarrassment. Look at you. you that nothing good can ever come out of you. Hmm? Are you, are you. You tried to win your late brother's wife in her own house hey. while she's still in mourning. Ah, oh, this man, you're a disgrace. Eh? What kind of human being are you? What kind of man are you? Hey! Teresa, please, please calm down. Let's handle this issue on ground. Don't even tell me to calm down because this man is an embarrassment, a disgrace, not just to this village but to the whole world. Hey! Don't you have any control, no self control? Listen, I'm here to warn you. Don't ever come close to me, nor to my children, nor near my premises. Else, I will teach you a lesson you will never forget. I will disman you if you try it. He goes without horns. Mm. Nonsense. Let me Osuji. find you near me again. Oh, Suji, you are a disgrace to this family. Hey. Susan, oh, Suji. you see why your Suji was asking oh, us to relax? He had an ulterior motive. Hey. Oh, Suji, you are a disgrace to this family. Hey. I didn't know you were up to this. Greedy really and selfish one at that. Hey. What a life. You are a disgrace hey. to this family. No wonder you asked us to relax. Because you have your plan. Evil plan. Come on, you're my brother. Hey, hey, hey. Why did you leave my car to fix another person's car? You know, you know how long I've been waiting for you? Are you silly? It's a day of that with pressure. It's a good one. Hey, listen, listen. Leave that car right now. Go and fix my car. What's wrong hey, with you? What's wrong with you? Please don't push it. What is your point? Did I talk to you? How are you, you manalist? How can you come from nowhere and ask him to stop fixing the car he's fixing and fix yours? What nonsense is that? I was talking about my car, not even your car. And where the hell is your car? You can see your manalist. Are you mad? What, what kind of dog are you? What breed are you? Why are you barking? I don't beat women. If I do, I will beat the hell out of you. Please, you're a toothless dog. Will you fix this car? Nonsense! Hey, fix this car. If I come back up, please, will you evaporate from this place? Get out! What is the guy you talking about? Borough pose. Nonsense. My friend, fix this car. Money, no, no. Why is what? My car broke down. I just see so much. Just visit us like a president. Once in a while. Oh, wow. How is it? How are you going? They are fine. They say they are fine. Don't tell me that you and your visible boyfriend are back together. Who says he's invincible? Hmm? And why haven't I met him? 
You haven't met him because you were too busy. Before we had the last fight. But Kiki has met him. So I have a surgical school for him. Mm, he's doing well. And soon he'll be through. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's really growing in his career. Mm -hmm. Do you know that Dr. Hassan was about 40 years or more Ooh. when he finished from um, West African School of Surgeons? Mm. So for your boyfriend to be there, he should be intelligent. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, you meet him, okay? Do you know, I was shocked when he told me that his father's sister got married to a native of this village. Really? Yeah. <laughs> he said he's coming to see them, so try to stay in the city. Wedding bells are ringing. What a coincidence. Yeah, yeah, you can see that again. Um, <laughs> I can't wait to see him. Yeah, you will. Don't worry. I'm going to school him. Huh? Please. Do you know what it is? Please. Anybody in this family? Do not disturb his school head. I see if he can do anything. So he's talking. <laughs> Man. Boy. <laughs> Papa. So you can be this cool. I mean, I know the whole show is that tactical. And anyone could fall for it. But no one can believe you, except I, your storm. Okay, now tell me, Papa, how do you intend to cope this shame and disgrace that that witch of a woman and her children has painted you with? How? Ah, Papa, are you going now? Yes, but I will be back shortly. Okay. This means that Teresa will not leave any pain for us here. Hmm. No way. I must get a hold of something. Whether by hook or crook, I must ransack that home. There's this feeling I'm having. Divine Joseph. Have you had another revelation? Nat, please. I wasn't talking to you. What is it? Are you my mom? I'm talking to her, please. Mom. Yes. I'm having this funny feeling. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. As if something bad is about to happen to us. I don't know. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. 
Well, don't you think maybe it has to do with the fever you complained about last night? Malaria. Mom, please, it's not that. I'm fine. It's not that. I know what I'm saying. Let me explain something to you. Most times when people have fever, it comes with hallucination, nightmares, all kinds of negative things that affect the brain. But not to worry, later today I'll take you to see the doctor. Mom, it's not the fever. I'm fine. I'm fine, it's not the fever. Ah, so let me start taking things seriously. Now watch how you talk to your mother. Is it me you're being awful? I, 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 I won't take it, all right? I'm sorry. You're better <laughs> What's funny? So, my name this is uh, where we get uh, from here. You get to the middle. Oh, yeah. Middle. <laughs> <laughs> I think she's around. Really, your auntie? See, what is wrong with you? I don't know. I feel somehow. Somehow nervous. about why? Right? I don't know if I'm going to be loved. Oh, my aunt will like you, okay? Really? Seriously, she's a very nice person. And you believe everything she says? Why not? I do. Just calm down, you, you love her too. Right? Okay. Alright. <laughs> My son. Hey, how are you? How are you? I'm fine, you? I brought some for you. I see. Hey, hey, hey. You don't know why I am. Why am I? As I know you like her. Is she not Oh, yes, yes, yes. Hey! You want to marry her? Hey! God forbid. You can't marry from that family. They are very arrogant. I will not be part of this. Besides, your father will not be part of this. See, let me tell you. Be warned. Be warned. Before I turn around, just take this girl out of my family. Take this girl out of here. This arrogant girl. Get her out from here! Ha! You want to marry? You don't, you, you don't even see any other place to get married! From Teresa's family! God forbid! No, go, go, go! Get her out! I don't want to see her again! Go, go, go! go.
Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, Sabadina. I don't know. I can't get her on phone. Oh, she's left to take us to the hospital. What should we do now? I'm too tired and I can't drive. Eh? Anyway, maybe we should check to the hospital. Trey. It's not too far from here. Let's go. It's not far now. We can let's go. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. leave the car open. some documents and vandalize my car. While they were inside the car, vandalizing it, your son started shaking, checking, and then he passed on. Una, I will not be part of anything diabolical. What are we even talking about? The police are already investigating the case. Let us wait for them to come up with the results of the investigation. They will know how to handle the matter. Now my son is dead because of you. Bet me you will leave this village without a child as well. Mm -hmm. Not so quiet. You will lose all your children before I lose one of mine. You are not ashamed of yourself, old man. You think my, my, my children will die before you? You don't even know what you're saying. We are covered by the blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. Oh, this man, you've not seen anything. The Holy Spirit lives in this house and within my children. I'm more fiano and pama. Two old men walking around looking for blood to suck. Blood suckers. Um, I'm more fear. Mom, can't you wait, please? It's just a few hours this morning, please. No, Let's wait. We can't wait. The drive is not too long. It's just four hours from here. Okay? And God will be with us. I'm not just comfortable with this night drive. Seriously, I'm not, Mom. Look at our young man. He's afraid of the dark or what? We're leaving. Divine here says we can go, and all your sisters are saying we can leave, right? Yes, I want to go. There's nothing wrong in living this night. I can even drive it once. Let's go this night. Let's just go. No, let's just go. Are these all we're going with? Yes. We're yes. leaving the rest let's of the go. things behind. Till we come back. Yes. So we're really going? Yes, we are. Bring what? Bring this. Come back here. Oh, are you for real? Excuse me. I'll make sure I drop you in the bush. Look at this child. If you ask me, I'm running from the village. Oh, God. It feels so good. Really? Yes. Yes, it does. The... Oh, we arrived home safely. And most yeah, importantly, we conquered everything. We didn't really conquer because of our education. 
and physical strength, even by the grace of God. <coughs> yeah, he asked me. <coughs> and so we always put the light first and Sister Babe. Ah, she's right now. This is true. <laughs> Evangelist. This <laughs> one I don't. What are you doing here? I, I, I left the village the day you said goodbye. It wasn't my intention to leave you. How did you even know you're back? I called your line but it wasn't going through so I had to call your mom. She told me. Oh. Will you marry me? Please. You know, they say men are moved by what they see and women by what they hear. But you, you are moved by what people say. I love my family and my health so much. I can't compromise. It's just serious. I know I love you. I cannot marry you. I can't. I can't marry a man who judge people by what he hears. I can't! Please. Goodbye to me. Please. <laughs> Please, have me there, please. <laughs> can, can, can you call her? Okay. Going to. Toby just called me. He said he's on his way to this place. Which Toby? <laughs> and how did he know that we are in our Matana home? <laughs> oh, yeah. He's on his own. And he's probably coming to see you. Huh? <laughs> that guy is a coward. Half of half of what a real man should be. Keke, okay, okay. that's too harsh. That's mean. See, Soma, I'm not me. You know I always say the truth. So, what is a woman's safety with a man like that? A man who cannot defend her before other women? Assuming his friends decide to be mean and say ill words about my sister, he will yield to the advice and kick her off without even having a second thought. Same thing. Good, radiant girl. Thank you very much. So, can we? Ah! Teresa, this is the second time we are discussing this and I will re not repeat myself anymore. Respect Ozobia for who he was and what he had always been. Go back to his house and complete the traditional rites as custom demanded. Papa, I am not going anywhere. Papa, I want a bench. <laughs> Papa, if you know what my daughters and I went through in the hands of those wicked and diabolic Elders, you won't advise us to go back. Papa Biko Biko, just wrap one here, baby. You should realize that Osobia was a kind and respectable man. In this family, we have respect for traditions. We do not flout it. Please, listen to me. Go back there and complete the rites. As their custom demands. Papa, I'm not going anywhere now. I'm not going anywhere. This is my father's house. I will stay here until the morning period is over. Hey. Then we will go back to the city. Wait. Papa, or did not possible? Uh, stubborn, stubborn. Since since you were born, you've been like this. No change. Papa, <laughs> I obviously took after someone that I'm looking at. But grandpa, 
Those people are diabolic and fetish. Tell me. They could cause harm to mom and us. It was only God who saved us the last time that we went there. They will cause no harm to you. If you are afraid, I will personally take you back to them. Ah. Yes. Superman, Papa. You will take us back. And you think if I go back there with you, they will beat me? Did you hear what your granddaughter called you? Grandfather. It was in Colombia. So Saka Yakwa Yakato. Papa, leave that matter. We're staying here. We're staying here. Papa. Papa. What am I hearing? What happened? Papa, talk to me. Calm down first. Papa, I don't want to calm down. What happened? What am I hearing? My story is a long story. Let's get inside first. I will explain to you. I'll talk to you later. I'll be my mother. What happened? Don't worry, my son. I'm not your father telling you. Let's get inside first. Come on. Come on. This happened when we left for mom's place. These people are asking for trouble, obviously. But why don't you wait for mom and grandfather to come back before alerting the police? This is obviously Osuji's handwork, and I'm not scared of his vices. Hmm? And this is grandfather's fault. So I suggest he stays here with us throughout this fetish period. Come on, why are you agitating fearfully? Hey, babe, come on, this is nothing compared to what you saw way back in school. When your classmates or roommates receive threats such as this from courtists, they relax. Nothing. This is nothing. This is not, this this is not breaking nothing. bottles or using guns. This is diabolic. This is fetish. Forget you. Nothing. Please don't touch anything. Leave them the way they are. I'm so. Where's the van? Where's the van? I don't know. Maybe she's somewhere praying. Oh, she tries to sanctify the house. <laughs> Didi! Divine! Divine! We have come here to have peaceful conversation with you because of the respect we have for our son-in-law and too because of the respect we have for tradition. We have not come here to seek favors for you. So do not act as if we have come to beg you for money. Because you have nothing to offer. Ichi, don't speak to us with such disrespect. Respect is reciprocal. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, your daughter here has violated our customs on several occasions. Mm -hmm. She flattered our tradition. She has no respect for any of us. What, what are we supposed to do as elders? We did what we were supposed to do. If you have presented your rights decently and in a responsible manner, my daughter here would have performed all the rights as your custom demanded. But you did otherwise. And it is obvious that you have a hidden agenda. Eche, enough is enough. I hope you did not come to our village here to insult us. You did not come here to insult us. I will not take it. <laughs> Eh? We, 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 are, we are not here so that you will pour all your anger on us. 
Enough is enough. We are only respecting your age. Mazi, we brought her back here because of the respect of your family. Allow her to leave. Wrap your go, Biri. Uh-uh. I will not take a candle from you people. If anything happens to her, to any of them. I shall eh? just hold it. Is that a threat or what? Eh? Listen, you may call it a threat, but it's not a threat. It is a warning. You are warning us in our house. It's a, also, are you going to beat me? Enough is enough, mm -hmm. peacemakers. Mm -hmm. So you told her you come for peace, you come here, you, you, you actually came for what? You see it? Mm -hmm. My father, like daughter, no wonder. Can, can, can I like a sorry? Eh? Yeah. What? No wonder. You should do the right thing. Huh? Let's say you have daughters. Is that the way you treat your daughters? Papa! Hey, stand up, stand up, stand up! Let's go. Okay. Uh, we can't take this rubbish. <laughs> I told you that this woman was the person that killed my brother. You are right. Ah, ah. Papa, what gave them the gods to threaten us? No, I want to know. What gave them the gods to threaten us? Eh? In fact, why would such a meeting even hold in my absence? Why? Okay, I know what to do. Thank God they announced their arrival. Thank God they announced their arrival because the war has just begun. I'm coming. I know what to do. Face. Your mother thinks she can kill my own brother and go scot free in this lady, okay? You can leave me alone. I didn't do anything to All you. Alright, no. I will bother you here and now. You can leave me alone. Messiah, no. give a tata. You can leave me alone. You can leave me alone. I'll bother you here today. You can Imagine. How dare Osuji, uh, Osuji's hoodlum lay his filthy, crooked uh, uh, hands on my daughter? What kind of rubbish is this? I didn't mean to. I just think I should come back to my problem. And I bumped into him. He arrested me. He blamed us for his brother's death. I said I don't want to learn from you. What? Did he trust you? Why would he? Sorry, dear. That boy needs to be treated psychologically. He's losing some nuts already. And he needs therapy. And that he will get for free as soon as possible. Oh, Suji and his good blood. Why would that boy lay his filthy hands up on my baby? Yeah? What kind of nonsense is this? They are pushing me to the wall, though. If I do my own now, people would say that I've started again. They shouldn't even push me to the wall. They shouldn't try it. What kind of nonsense is this? Mom, it's okay. It's okay. This is not in fact. I know you're filled with rage within, but let's handle this, please. Why? He needs to be taught a lesson. DK needs to be taught a lesson. Mom, please. We don't need to confront the fool. He's just a ganja driven idiot. And he will just do about anything to have his way. We need to use our brains. You sound scared, though. What you say? Nas, I think Divine needs to run back and some massage. Please take her inside. I'll give you a light massage after you have he has tossed the con and will play it just like that. First thing in the morning, we'll place a call to the police and we'll present Unjokwa and Usuji as a prime suspect of the last break in. We'll tell them they assaulted our little sister, they made away with her phone, and some other things, you know. Doesn't it sound convincing? Okay. 
What are you saying? What do you mean? Mom, we'll have to capitalize on the police investigation from the last report. TK has just willfully submitted himself as a culprit. So, what, what, what are we going to do? Everybody knows he's a criminal. So, we don't need to add too much story to it. It will pass. So, how do you make this? Thank God for your quick response. So, what happened? Sir, she said she was in the living room surfing the internet on my laptop when it just happened like that. Now, he made away with the laptop, her phone, some jewelry, documents. I hope she's okay. Or oh, is she injured? Sir, he hit her so hard on the cheek. God. Held her neck so tight, he almost strangled her. So, where is the young girl? We would like to see and speak with her. She's inside, although she's asleep. Maybe people should come in. Yes, please come in, sir. Alright. Maybe we should go ahead and wake her up. No, 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 please, please. Oh, officer, please don't wake her up. This girl just slept off now. Officer, you, you know what? Tomorrow she will come to the station and lay whatever complaint. Why don't you just continue with the investigations first? No, no, she's right. She's right, we understand. She can come over to the station when she's fit. But for now, we'll go ahead with our investigation at the residence of the suspect. So please, excuse us. Oh, thank you so much, officer. And you can see them all. Thank you, sir.
So here. Who owns this? So I don't know. We haven't had any male visitors of recent. Do you know who you are? Officer, sir, do you know that this could belong to the criminal? Yes, of course. We will take this along and see what it brings. It's an exhibit. You are a witch. Was that why you took a foot of that man's down paper? <laughs> oh. What do you think I was doing? I'm not here to explain it. That was very, very thoughtful of you. But my only problem now is design. You know how truthful she can be. I don't know go there and pick it also. Divine has dare not mess this up, but I'll kill her with my bare hands. Well, I pray they should not just invite her to that police station to go and give any statements. Now, girl, can you tell her what to say? Don't worry. Who is making that noise there? Huh? Why are you disturbing our peace? Young man, bring down your voice. Don't tell me to bring down my voice. What are you doing here? Bring down your What's voice. That? What are you doing here? Why are you doing here? Young man, bring down your voice while speaking to a law enforcement agent. Other police, what do you want? We are here to search these premises. For oh, what? Search where? Okay, where is your search warrant? <laughs> Show us your search warrant! Show us your search warrant. warrant! By the way, who owns that slippers? It's my slippers, and so? Where is the second foot? Can you imagine that? Why are you demanding that? You're asking me to do something my father's house about the slippers. Show me the second foot! Is it your business? What's your business with my slippers? Leave my slippers alone. Hey! Is this the second foot? Yes. Young man, you one. are under arrest. What? Yes, for breaking into Ozobia's house. No, listen. Okay. Listen, like you're not missing. Well, this is your friend. There's a mistake. Don't say anything. Don't say anything. Or it will be used Ma against you in the court of law. Something is wrong somewhere. My son is innocent. My son is innocent. What's that again? Oh, damn it. I said that you don't understand. You're, you're, you're. Now move it. Officer, move. 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 That was careless to go to their house. Didn't you advise DK not to touch the lioness tail? You know how smart Teresa and those daughters can be. Eh? Come on. No matter what they can do, I will surely deal with them. I will deal with them one by one. Could you imagine that that, that rat, that small rat, lied against my son in the police station, thereby increasing the trouble loads on my son? Hey. That little one. Hey. These are those, those are crooks she called daughter. But I thought uh... it, it don't work. Okay, it's okay. Let me go and look for money to release my son from the south. Then later they will know who I am. If you get the money, whenever I want to go, come here, I will try to go with you. Eh? But you know? Hey, there is a because I told him that those three notorious girls and their mother are crook and corner. You can imagine what happened to you. cannot compare to what happened to your brother and what we, your family members, went through because of Teresa and her three notorious daughters. You can imagine how they took us on our way. If I had been that you and I are not careful, these women could have bundled us overnight. 
By tomorrow morning, you got ourselves in a ship to Cameroon. I've said it. Hi. My son. You can't go to more than I can. I don't know, man. Woman and I'm trying to protect her. Protecting your woman, my food. You think embarrassing her on the street in the public is how you protect your woman? I mean, you have to learn. Women are meant to be treated with so much love and care. Not treating her this way. She deserves more than that. Look at a beautiful girl like this. You're treating her this way and you call her your woman. God. Please just go now. Go. Leave me alone, please. No. It's not over yet. I will not let you know. I love it when women are being treated the right way. I mean, you women are like egg and should be pampered. Sorry, eh? Okay. Yeah. But who are you? Um, my name is George. Okay. George Iluno. Oh, I'm Natalie. Natalie. Well, I think I know already because um, I've been seeing you around a couple of weeks now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. um, I have to hurry up to the side. Mm -hmm. Um, but I would love to see you again. Okay, so where do you stay? Um, directly opposite the secondary school. Secondary, okay, the secondary school now. Okay, okay, that okay, one. okay, okay. I'll, I'll come around one of these days and see you. Okay. That's good. So I have to hurry up to the side now to meet up with workers, okay? Right. Take care. Thank you so much. All right, bye. Papa, Papa. I slept in the police cell because of those stupid girls. Oh, this is the height of it. I will deal with them one by one. I will deal with them one by one. I will pay them back in my own coin. And my cargo kukumba. And my cargo kukumba. Okay, I know what to do. No, don't worry, I know what to do. Okay. Now we'll soon be here. Mom, it's getting late and I'm a bit worried. What if he changed his mind and went back? You know, some very careful people would not want to miss the right route to find themselves in the midst of nowhere. The worst of it all is his number is no longer connected. And he's a stranger here. Calm down, Sonia. He'll find his way here. He'll probably ask around and get directions. Are you going to stay out here and wait for him all day? Oh yeah, let's go inside. Go inside and wait because this is all just for one second. Go inside. So all of you were sitting here waiting for the man to come. Hey. Hey. Hey.
before I lost network. That name should be from Amako here. And Amako here is like seven villages from here. My God. Yeah, you have to drive like two hours. Two hours drive? Yeah. Oh my God. This journey is so stressful since morning. Seven villages again. If you waste time here, go blow us for land. Something must have held him up. All right? Should I now accept that as a reason for the disappointment? First of all, his number is not connected. When I can't reach him, we we're not communicating. Not to worry. Everything happens for a reason. It's getting late already. Soon night will come and then the next day. Then we'll know exactly what happened. Okay? I'm sure you get in touch. Mom, I'm just going to go inside. I want to be over by myself. I want to go and brood and think and I'll be fine. You sure? Yeah. Well love does to my daughter. <laughs> Take care. You want some of my drink? Okay. Start. I don't know what to do next. Are you serious? Yes, sir. I've tried all I could. Nothing's working. Uh, so, what's your next plan? Uh, just waiting for the night to fall more than this, then I will roll up the gun and sleep inside. Eh? You want to sleep here? I have no other choice. God forbid. You know, now, I won't even advise my enemy to fight them. This place can be very, very dangerous and deadly at night, so don't even try it, okay? Really? Uh, but I have a place where you can see. Uh, but the place, you see, the place is so bad. They have all these uh, shower girls there, and they still have good accommodation. If you want to eat out on your own, and you still want to just sleep, they have nice places to sleep. My brother, my brother, with my condition, I just need where to put my hair. I don't need anything. Don't need uh, anything. Yeah. Uh, in 
que a ausência ou não e a ausência ou não de combate aqui bem não se mete hein Mata si na neya malalola, oji kwa dochi na ka, makanja ba ni ebi nego kwa. I know guri, I know guri. Listen, this is a listen carefully. This is a life I deal. Don't mess it up, Ozi. I'm warning you. Don't mess it up. Are you hearing me? I swear, if you mess this thing up, I will kill you. Yes. Now listen. Yes, me. Yes. What are you giving me? Look, what this? I will pay you with cash, drinks, even girls. But make sure you don't disappoint. Just deliver first, okay? Go now. So we're giving you the money. Don't worry. Just go first. Don't disappoint. Don't mess up. 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 I'm not here for any immoral activity. Immoral what? It must be nothing. Oh, look, I'm not here for this. Madam, I need a... Enough of a phone call, okay? So, Madina! Elvis, you came! What are you doing in the portal? What? What now? Did you just call my home a brothel? Are you? Huh? Elvis, this is not a brothel. This is my home. This is my mom and my sister. I've been expecting you. What is he talking about? Don't tell me you and your mother run a brothel. You shut up. Shut up, I said. How dare you walk in here and call us prostitutes? Come, is this the young man named Elvis you've been waiting for? This foul-mounted human being! Eh? But Elvis... Don't come anywhere close to me. Are you crazy? So Martina, where in the world did you get this, this human being from? I wonder. Elvis, if this is a brothel, then what are you doing here? To pick up a prostitute for a one night stand? Look, I came to book a room where I will pass the night. I'm coming here to see all this. Elvis, what has come over you? Look. The most painful thing in my life is to come to my fiancé's village to find out that she and her family are all prostitutes. What? Uh, Elvis, please, I don't know whosoever would have said this to you. Baby, calm down. Oh, uh, listen to me. I don't want to have anything to do with you and your family. Will you get out of here? Get out of here! Shut up! Listen, if you take one more step, you'll see one tonight. You call that thing a human being? Oh, that guy is an otondo. Eh? It, it says this human being for you to come in here and call us prostitutes. 
Mommy, Elvis is not like this naturally. Elvis is not like this natural. No, no, get Cody. Naturally, he's not like this. Boom. You must still have a boyfriend. Exactly. You used to be the smartest. I thought you were smart, but obviously. Elvis, why? Elvis, why? Because we're trying to find out the answer. Come on, son. Stop crying. Men aren't worth your tears. You don't have to put up with all this now. You of all people. You should have known that probably a hater or someone must have said something stupid about us to him. You know, you, you obviously. Just like they did with Toby. And it worked. It's only an indecisive and a less confident person that will do something like this. was supposed to have listened to you and not just draw conclusion from what he had. But why do we always meet men like this? Eh? Men that would rather believe what other people say about their ladies than who they really are. Come on, Tim, just let it go. It's okay. But wait, what is it with the, the news of breakups up and down here? Here and there? What was all this? Gosh! I'm getting tired of every day. Breakups, breakups, heartbreak. Hey! Wait, oh! What if DK or his father is behind this? Do you like your right? No, I'm not right. DK? Yes! It's okay. All I need is your commitment to carry out this job. We don't need to be traced. We don't need to be suspected. I know I can do it. Fine. We'll start when it's your time of the month. Like your monthly period. You know, with the blood and all that, it will be a whole lot easier to convince people that you are truly raped. <laughs> You're making a face. Young lady, it's a dirty job. It takes only filthy ideas to carry out vengeance. Deal or no deal? Deal. Good. So, you give me a call when it's your time of the month, like when you start your period, okay? Okay, I will. All right. You can go now. Thank you. You shouldn't be doing this. Why don't listen to me for once? Give me that privilege, please. Such privileges don't exist. Okay? I hate seeing you around there. Please let me go. You know how much I hate being stopped. Don't treat me like I never existed in your life. We once had affections. Which you trampled upon? Huh? You crushed it and bade it farewell the minute you totally undermined me and my sisters. Now please, let me go. And I refuse to let you go. Just let listen, me listen, go! Listen, listen, listen. We, we can fix things up. We are meant to be together. Please. For the last time, let me go. Let me go! Yes! You shouldn't be surprised that I did something like this. Once a notorious woman is always a notorious woman. Now please, stay away from me and let me go! you to walk into the scene of the incident and then I'll take a call to the police. Immediately I'm done with the call, I'll leave and you can take it up from there. Is that okay? okay. When you're done with this, you take her to the local pharmacy. The young man there knows what to do. Okay. 
at the end of this whole drama, your story will be that a young girl is afraid of stigmatization and she has gone to the city to do with her parents. Something like that. Okay, madam. You don't have any cause to worry, okay? I will be just that. And I'll be very pleasant. And you should dress like a mother would. So everything will fall in place. So see you. I'll have your money in time. Officer, please, there's been a rape incident in the neighborhood, Mr. Osuji's areas to be precise. Yes, at, at Ogwe village. So the young girl has been brutally raped. She's, she's been thrown out of the house. Yes, sir, please. Thank you very much. That you don't know what I'm talking. By the time I finish with you, you be girls, you will know that I or should you 
It's a man. Jesus Christ. Prison. Don't worry. By the time I see you, you people must be punished. You must pay for the punishment. We'll just watch and see. Sorry. Oh, Trust me, I'm innocent. I know you now. Dika, I know you. <laughs> so this whole thing was except of that one. Exactly. Of course. But why if I'm asking? Listen, I said I'm innocent. Don't you trust me? You've known me for years. I didn't. Do you have any problem with that? No. So who could be behind all this? And I'm very confused. The DK I know can be stubborn. Not a rapist or any. You understand? No problem, DK. Just relax. Staying here is just for a minute, okay? Yes. Do everything possible to make sure you come out of this place. Uh -uh. I feel your pain, bro. Everything will be fine. Oh, yeah. Hand off. I'll go back to your cell. Just calm down, okay? Calm down. If you know this man here, he's not meant to be here. That was a clean deal. Nice one. <laughs> the so called parents of the victim refused to press charges because of stigmatization. <laughs> <laughs> that was a brilliant response you gave to the police. Are you guys good to go? Yes, sure. Um, here's a little something for your extra effort. Thanks a lot, I appreciate this. Thank you. Alright then, you guys take care. and forge ahead. Did you forget about what happened. Let bygone be bygone. We have better things to talk about. Please. I mean, we are your men. We are here for you, okay? Come on. And Dicky, I think your year is right. You know, just let yesterday go. Today is a new day. Start afresh. Just forget them. 
Forgive me. No, I won't. Oh, God. Those girls are annoying. They feel special and on top of the world. I want to ridicule them. I want to bring their pride down. I want to set confusion in their midst. Listen, I have a good plan. All I need is your support. So, how do you intend to do that? Good. You will play the legitimate son of Chief Williams or Zobia. And you will play the character of a good suitor. They are desperately in need of men. So, one man can cause confusion in their midst. Yeah. I think um, it's becoming interesting. From the storyline, it's the game will be fun. I'm in. <laughs> Come on, my man. We'll do anything for you. Are Once that will bring you joy. Somadina. Now you want to take the risk for you and even you know to your <laughs> Throw this thing here. Throw it away. Yay, I have a risk one.
channel is only a residence, I suppose. Yes, it is. Please, who are you? Okay. Yeah. Uh, actually, I am Ala Mark Daniel Zubia, Zubia's first son. And um, I was out of the country when I got the news and uh, information got to me that he has been... Please, I don't, I don't understand you, mister. <laughs> Just spoke Greek, right? <laughs> so why is that not understand? Well, uh, my father gave me this address before he died and um, I came to pay my respect to his family. And uh, yes, he has never been married to my mom. I will not claim he has. So can I come in? No, please. I don't know you or your fabricated stories. Who are you? <laughs> I told you where I am already. Listen to me, mister. I don't know you, okay? And let all secrets be gone. Please leave. I don't know you. Well, I will back when the lawyer puts me a call. He never mentioned it to us. I was shocked when this guy said this to me. I was very shocked. He was so bold to see the way he walked in. I don't want to believe this. I don't want to believe it. Can you imagine? That doesn't have a company for Harcourt. Don't sound so sure, Soma. Was it not just a few weeks before he died that he told mom about the next state he named after her son in Niger? Two. But could it be possible that that house and the ultimate sound without me? I don't want to believe this. Has mom seen this? No. I decided to tell you girls first because she might have a heart ache. Let's leave mom out of this. Recently, I've noticed she's been battling with depression. I'll look into this. This is a joke. I can't believe this. I can't. Hey, mom. There's someone I want you to meet. Oh. He's such a nice person. He's so handsome. You're going to love him, you see? Mm -hmm. Trust me. <laughs> so, who is this so nice, so whatever? Don't worry, I want you to meet me. Yes, you will. He's nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You will. Okay, <laughs> say so. Okay. We're here now. You doesn't make me cheat, does it? I've not said that, have I? You have. Though indirectly. When he asked, I couldn't say no anymore. Because this is the third time he's asking. No. Please try and be nice to my friends. You know. But I was nice to him. But you know what? Look. All the things you've just said don't make sense to me. My problem here is that you meet a guy. You bring him home to meet your folks. Fine. And then you break up. 
Then you bring another guy, introduce him to your folks, and then it goes on and on. Come on. Hello, Hello everyone. Oh, so Marjana, how are you? Fine, thank you. What is the gift to come? <laughs> it's a package from my secret admirer. I feel like I met him. I see. Hey, please stop. How can you be so careless? Huh. You don't open gifts from unknown sources like that, please. Mom, it's not a bomb. Stop being apprehensive. Keep it quiet. I'm not being apprehensive. I'm just being careful. Sorry, my bad. But it's just a package. To my heartbeat and strength, Natalie. Mm. Natalie? Who sent it? George, Eluno, GE. Yes. Go on, get out of here! Go on, get out of here! Go on, mommy! It was a 
is set up. It was organized by Dick and his friends. Uh, what? Dick has set this whole thing up with his friends? I didn't yes, I overheard George speaking on the phone with Dick. Even though they, they, they regretted be, be, being part of the evil act. Are you saying they did all this to smite us? And to place us on the edge of this world? They did it on purpose. To set us on edge and ruin us. Saturated with all the challenges so far. Well, oh, we should go. Yeah, we should. Oh, mom, we can come and see. Are you ready? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Good morning. What are you doing here this early? I slept in this place last night to be here this morning so that when Soma wakes up, I will be the first person she will see. Please call her for me. Soma? So, Sam? Please come. Please don't walk away. I'm truly sorry. Look, I'm sorry, Soma. Soma, please. Please. Show me some if your relationship has this good chance. Please. Look, Soma, I don't care what anyone think or say. I'm truly sorry. I Please, I know my reaction the other day was so spontaneous and unthoughtful, but I am begging you, forgive me. Forgive me, Soma. Come on, Soma, come on. I'm sorry.
peace me joy whenever we are in Baby, 